February is Black History Month, and all of us at the McMichael have been thinking a lot this month about Denise Tomasos. We were very proud and happy to present uh, Denise Tomasos' Odyssey, an exhibition which I co-curated with uh, the wonderful Gaetan Verna from the Power Plant. Uh, we opened that show in the fall, and it is now toured on to the Archaeology Grade of Victoria, where it still has a few more weeks to run and to in, into the middle of March. But, you know, one of the other wonderful things that happened when we made that commitment was that we were also able to bring in a major work, uh, Odyssey, into our collection. And I think that work really tells you everything you need to know about Denise and her interest in um, the Middle Passage, in exodus and exile, in historical trauma, and the, the movement forward. And what you see when you look at this painting is, you know, maybe it's a city, maybe it's a boat, um, maybe it's a, a graveyard and these are coffins. You know, it's always very unclear, you know, precisely what you're seeing when you look at a painting by Denise Tomasos. We only wish that she was here to talk to us about her beautiful works in person. Very, very sadly, she died 10 years ago, uh, very unexpectedly and very young, but not before leaving a sort of indelible mark in the history of Canadian art. And we're so proud to have been a part of her legacy. I should mention to you all that we did a beautiful book on Denise's work uh, with a lead essay by Essie Adogian, the fantastic Victoria-based author and author of Washington Black, and also of this new book of Essie's, which is called Out of the Sun, uh, her Massey lectures. So it was great that she was able to give us her time and, and her beautiful energy for our book. Um, I should also say the Archaeology of Ontario is going to be doing a major exhibition of Denise as well coming later on this year, and we're all very excited to see that. And also that those of us who might be able to get to New York to see the Whitney Biennial this year, uh, opening in early April, Denise will be a featured artist in that very important show. So, you know, we just wish... Uh, that she was here to see all this happening with her legacy at last, and we're so proud to have uh, played a small role in uh, recognizing her enormous talent and contribution.